Hey guys, my name is Ru Rees and welcome to Vietnam Halong Bay Part 2. In this vlog, we're going to be going on the back of a speedboat and a little donut thing. We're going to be doing some kayaking, we're going to be jumping off the boat. There's a little bit of Hanoi on there. We're going to be finishing off the boat party as well. So, um, enjoy! at all it actually looks super super slow but when you're on the back of it it feels like you're going absolutely hectically fast and then when you come off like sometimes you come off and you kind of go backwards it feels like it nearly knocks your nose off so yeah just bear in mind it feels a lot faster than it looks because it does not look fast but it feels super fast <laughs> some context on what days it is. The speed boating was actually on the first day and then the boat party was actually on the second day. So was the kayaking, so was the jumping off the boat. So we kind of went back to the first day in speed boating. Now we're going back to the second day, back on the boat. The boat party is happening, the kayaking is happening and the jumping off the boat is also happening. Kayaking, uh, we basically stopped off in this really, really, really nice spot where it was two to a kayak. We all jump in, we all had about four or five cans each in the, in the kayak so we can bring them with us. Obviously they got warm pretty quick. It didn't matter, it was absolutely six. So then we basically just went on a tour for about two or three hours in the kayaks, having a few cans. And it was, oh, it was so good to be fair. after like sort of touring around for a little bit going through all these sort of like coves and all that type of stuff we ended up stopping off for a bit we had a little bit of a history lesson we had a few more cans played a few more drinking games we were actually in the kayaks and then we start heading back to the boat So 
while back on the boat, it was really dope. We stopped off in that really, really nice place, as I mentioned earlier. We got to jump off the boat, we got to piss about in the sea, we got to like carry on drinking. And the really, really lucky thing was, is we had such a good group of people that everyone was just super sound, everyone was getting along with each other, just having a super, super good time. It was an absolutely sick day. sick day of partying all day, the kayaking, jumping off the boat. See, the boat makes its way back to the little private island, the little private beach. Now, we are the guys coming back from the boat party, our second day, and there's a new group of arrivals on the beach waiting for us. It's their first day, which I explained that we were on Vietnam part one. And if you haven't seen that, then I'll put a link below so you can see that as well, so you get what I'm saying. So we come back, we're basically the guys who have been drinking all day and we're kicking off coming into the beach. <laughs> Then we have a good f***ing time! Yeah. Number two, are we going to sleep? No! Yeah. Number three, are we going to the f***ing bar? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shut the f*** <laughs> up! <laughs> we are away, so we are cast away! <laughs> After we get back in, as you can imagine, same as the first night, we have a massive party that night, which is absolutely awesome. We all wake up super, super hungover the next day, then we've got to make our way back to Hanoi, back to Vietnam, backpackers. Give us away, bro. <laughs> Even though we're all super, super hungover, obviously from the last two days of partying, we end up getting cans at every stop that we have on the way back. So even by the time we get back to Hanoi, we're basically back on it again. Then we end up partying down at Downtown Backpackers. That was basically the end of, uh, end of the three days. So, unfortunately,
unfortunately, that is all we have time for on Vietnam Halong Bay part two. Coming up in the next episode, this one, one of my favorite things that I actually did the whole time I was traveling. Got a bunch of mopeds, there were six of us. We end up doing like what's called the Hai Zhang loop. I think I'm saying that right. We go from Hai Zhang, again, I don't know if I'm saying that right. Scooter all the way up to the Chinese border, turn around and then come back down, back down to Hai Zhang. Uh, it takes three days, I think it's roughly 80 to 100 kilometers a day. The views were ridiculous, everything was amazing. If you liked the video, please press the like button. If you want to see any of the other vlogs, the subscribe button. Thanks for watching, see you next time. But lying in your bed, many years from now, would you be, would you be willing to give the enemy just one chance that they may take our lives, but they'll never take our freedom? <laughs> Come here. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs>